Hi everyone, it's Rosalie. I am uh, currently sitting in a parking garage, uh, but when something strikes you, you just have to take it and share it. And that's what I feel like doing right now. So I recently got a job um, working as a, as a makeup artist for right now. I'm going to call it my day job. Uh, in the meantime, that's what I'm going to be doing while also working on getting into television, working at a, a television station, all that good stuff that I went to school for. And I started to think to myself, and um, I apologize, I'm getting over a cold. I started to think, this is really annoying. This is so frustrating having to do something that I don't 100% want to do. It's not that, uh, you know, I don't enjoy makeup or that I don't enjoy colors and the textures that makeup has to offer, but it's more that I know what I really want to do and not doing that is frustrating. So, uh, I want to talk about that period of time between deciding what you want from life and then getting there. That in-between time. The in-between. And this is where a lot of us are. We're in-between right now. And when you're in the in-between, you struggle, you go through a lot of mixed emotions, you have a lot to deal with, there may be a lot that you're dealing with all at once, everything that could happen is happening, and you're wondering, when is this all going to end, and when are you just going to be there, right? That's the in-between. And I'm here to tell you, because I just, I was thinking about this for weeks, that you will get there. You'll get there. It's hard, and it's not something that we all want to go through, but it's needed to polish you, to make you ready. There's a story, and I'm not really sure where I heard it from or who wrote it, but it is about a, um, it's about this butterfly and this old man. And this old man was watching this butterfly struggle to come out of its cocoon. So the old man, in his good heart, thinking that he would help the butterfly in its in-between to, you know, come out of the, the cocoon... He broke open the cocoon, and the butterfly, rather than coming out and flying, it fell straight to the floor. The struggle of the butterfly is what helps it to strengthen its wings and to fly off once it, once it breaks through. In the in-between, when it was a caterpillar, and in-between, turning into a butterfly, and then struggling and fighting that good fight and then breaking through and flying off. That's what it's all about. That is what it's all about. So while I go in and I work for the man, I want you all to know that in between is not going to last forever. It's not. Especially if you're working hard and you're focused and you're going after it, you'll get there. Also, I wanted to say thank you to all of you who responded to my last video about ADD and ADHD. I'm still doing my research on it, and um, I appreciate all your comments, but uh, I, I feel like there's a little bit more to it all. I really do. So uh, I will definitely keep you all updated on that, and uh, thank you to all of, all of my supporters, all of you, all of you who have subscribed recently. Thank you, and welcome. 
And um, now that I have an iPhone, I will definitely be sharing a lot more. And I've not forgotten about raw foods, so we're also touching upon that as well. Anyway, I hope you all have a great day, a great week, and I will see you later.